Okay, so while I was um, fixing, not really fixing, but uh, changing my oil on my 4Runner, uh, the, there's no oil in the engine right now. I have to uh, fill it up with some 10W30 oil. Um, just uh, looking, uh, just taking out the skid plate and just taking a look at this uh, underneath the car once again. Um, uh, I didn't, I already, I've been noticing this little piece right here, but uh, I didn't get the chance to show it to you. For those so people who don't know a lot about Forerunners, at least the second generation Forerunner, this right here has a this thing right here, this part of the frame, uh, which connects to the control arms and uh, pretty much some parts of the steering assembly. This right here is actually a bracket for the front differential. Uh, so, like I said before, that my Forerunner is not four wheel drive, but. Um, this bracket right here is supposed to hold the front differential and the front axle assembly. And then as you can see, that sway bar right there goes like that, it goes down a little bit, and then goes straight, then goes down even more, and then goes back up. So I'm guessing if this truck was four wheel drive, the transmission will have a transfer case and it'll have a little drive shaft that sticks out, which goes through there and then eventually it will hook up to the differential, which is located over here, right where this bracket will be at. Interesting. Hey, hey the more you learn uh, of your own car. So yeah, that's, uh, that's something I just later found. I mean, I, I was aware that there was a, a bracket for four wheel drive that goes here, but I did not know. I was been wondering why the heck does the, does the sway bar have a, goes downward even more. That's now I found I later found out just by looking at it. It's because of the transfer case if this car was four-wheel drive So if you if for those second-gen owners out there who actually own the ones that are four-wheel drive Take a look underneath the truck. You'll see that indentation and you'll see the front differential hooked up to this bracket over here but My forerunner is not four-wheel drive. So hence the hence the Toyota enthusiast calls this the two-runner Yeah, so anyways uh, Back to work.